Hello everyone, I'm Myrlurk Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Old World Blue. So last time, we took out the Rib Breakers. We took, of course, the Troll War in territory, but mostly the Rib Breakers territory, as well as their overlord, the Marrow Drinkers. But, right now, we have to definitely prepare ourselves for an oncoming war against the Western Brotherhood of Steel, which, I'll be honest, I'm not sure how that's going to go, because... As we discovered in the last episode, our clutch, Lulu's clutches, with our lurkers, they're not really that strong. Now, I think they're infantry. They're not armored. There's Behemoths. I can make behemoths that only have... Oh. Hmm. Interesting. But we're mostly just infantry. I'm, I'm assuming we're just infantry, so whatever. Yeah, these aren't special battalions. Can I make... Uh... But I all cost 30. And they don't really look that good. But that'd be amazing if I could make behemoths. Yeah, but I'll be honest, I'm really a little worried about the war against the Brotherhood of Steel because they're pretty strong. I mean, power armor? Sure, they won't have power armor for every division, but they'll have enough for enough divisions that I'm going to be really worried about me not being able to stand up to the enemy. So I'm going to get some anti-tank because I need that immediately, as well as things that go kaboom. So there you go. We got plenty enough melee equipment. I'm not worried about that. Throw that on there. We do have to keep a small eye on manpower because we already are... We're still mobilizing, of course. But we're on the highest conscription level. We had our eggs hatch. So... It's good to keep an eye on things. Let's just say it like that. Good to keep an eye on things. And we're going to make as many Mar Lurk shells as we possibly can right now. We do get one and a half political power a day, which isn't bad. I will continue to ask the followers of the apocalypse to help me with my buildings and whatnot quest follower aid medical technology actually that could be really good you know what i might just do that because medical companies not bad and honestly we got a lot of political power i don't know if i need all of it but we got craft coral tools for more civilian workshops great now we can do the king of malaya Oh, we can become civilized. We get cultural people, which gives us less political power and stability, but more research speed for 300 days. Now we can create or core states coastal to the Pacific Ocean for free. They worship, so they said, the great old ones who lived ages ages before there were any men and who came to the young world out of the sky. Those old ones were gone now, inside the earth and under the sea, but their dead bodies had told their secrets and dreams to the first men who formed a cult which had never died. This was a cult. And the prisoners said it had always existed and always would exist, hidden in the distant wastes and dark places all over the world until the time where the great priest Mlulu, from her dark house in the mighty city of Meliat, under the waters, should rise and bring the earth again beneath her sway. Ah, beautiful. Now, we're making some more divisions here. I'm telling these guys, you know, exercise and whatnot, but... Really? I'm gonna put you on low. I don't want to make you as much as I do want more Marlurks. Because these guys, they're exiled heretics. They're not bad. They're only 10 combat width. Which uh, isn't really good to use. So, you know what? I don't want to hurt my supply. Oh, I'm just thinking about maybe like getting rid of half these divisions and then making them 20 combat width immediately. But I'm going to go against idea that idea right now. Uh, you guys, I'm going to immediately just throw in some demo companies. Because that will help you with your breakthrough. Just a wee bit. A little more soft attack, hard attack. And slightly more... HP, but I think this will help us just a little bit more. It does hurt our piercing, but that's okay. Definitely do that. Actually, if I were to replace you with this, we would need less equipment. Less Mire Lurks, at least. Get even more breakthrough soft attack, hard attack. Maybe. Maybe. Pale Folk was annexed. Good. Exiled Heretics. I want you to have this as well, but not yet. I really want to make sure... Oh, there goes Kaiser's Legion declaring war on two sons. We definitely need more equipment there. You know what? I probably shouldn't do that, but that's okay for now. Do that for now. I'm building up forts here as well. I think these will come in handy if we build up forts. I think that'd be really good. I'm just... I'm a little worried that they're going to be coming at us pretty strongly. Followers demand reduced conscription. We got local workplaces. Great. By resist, resisting their demands, we lower our war support and political power. If I select it, we get first sons and daughters. Free manpower at least 13,000. Yeah, that's definitely not going to be there. Um, I don't care. Whatever. Now. Engineering. More research speed. Sounds good to me. We are already doing anti-tank stuff. And we're going to keep doing going down our land doctrine with Wasteland. Intuition. Hopefully, I don't know if this will happen. 
but maybe the Marlux can get some reconnaissance. It says lug infantry, which means probably not Marlux, but nah, probably won't happen. Whatever. Still mobilizing. That's great. Petition for technology. Ah, uh, that's not bad. Can I use my political poppers? Oh, we gotta save 60 of it because I'm gonna lose 60. Um. Hmm. I mean, we already have a lot here. Oh, the Kingdom of Mel. Oh, we're no longer a Marlux tribe. We're Melia. Melia. Oh, we is civilized now. I love civilization. Great. The Cascadian Current. Get a claim in West Oregon, West Washington, South Columbia, Northwest Columbia, Vancouver Island, and Graham Island. From ice, the kingdom rises. Um, yeah, I, I mean, I, I guess. That should last all game for us to have claims on these territories. Ooh, the kingdom of Mleia. The Mleia. I mean, last time we did also annex or combine with, um... The Apostles, which was great, which I really enjoyed. Uh, you know what? I'm going to further split you up. I want eight of you guys down here as well, because... Under Great Watcher Bingo! Because... Ooh, Idiot Savant. I actually might want to do Equipment Capture Ratio. That sounds kind of fun. I never do that. Oh, but 5%. 5%? It's only 5%, though. Oh, oh... I haven't done Mysterious Stranger yet. I want to put you down here. Oh, actually. What do you have? Jungle Rat. We're not fighting in jungles. You got more movement. You're a ninja. The land I'd attack. But you have more attack. Planning speed, max planning. You're also agile. Um, It really doesn't matter. So, what I'm thinking, you guys do this. You help double up on the line. But, you guys will be the guys kind of scurrying about, trying to figure out where to best defend if someone invades me. Next up, we shall do... The gang! More combat with. Great. Let's see, are we going to get paid soon? Hopefully. Or no. Oh, that's the uh, demobilize option, which I'm not going to do. Hmm. Basic hygiene. A little bit more weekly stability. Go ahead and do that. That sounds good to me for now-ish. Hold on. Uh, let's wait. Let's wait. Ooh, higher agricultural experts. Yeah, I want to do that eventually. Um, Just keep making stuff. We got a few behemoths. Marlux, looking pretty good. Oh, Spec Ops equipment, not bad. Uh, you guys, actually, you're looking pretty good. Oh, the Lost Clutch, you are not what I want. There you go. Now you have way less supply, whatever. That's fine with me. Ooh, they're dropping in experience. Yakuza territories declared war on them, that's fine. Two. Ah, that's one, two. Good, 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 good. Yeah, the Cascadian Current... I love it. From the ice, the kingdom rises. I don't know why the brother declared war, or is justifying on me. Look at that. Mleia. Because if I would, I would might just go to war with the bone dancers if they're independent. Old rivals. They also have, they have a, there's a lot of followers influence around here. Stand away, Aiden. Cascadian current. Searching shipwrecks is not bad. Coral home, that's a little better. That's, that's pretty good. I like the manpower and stuff. Oregon weapon trade. Infrastructure and arms workshops. Actually, I could use that right now. I need arms workshops. So, Oregon is a land of war and conflict among the tribes. By staying out of that, we can earn a hefty amount of caps by selling our weapons across the Columbia River to the warring tribes. Good. Yes, let us profit when everyone else is killing each other. And that failed. Oh well. Give me more stability. First, our research speed, but whatever. I don't care. Oh, military society. You know what? Do that. Basically, we get plus 50% stability, but then we get minus 50% stability. So basically, we get weekly war support for a few weeks. There they go. Now, this is concerning. Justified for... Yeah, why did you... Why do you want to kill me so badly? I don't understand. I really do not understand. Sending you guys, since you're, you're pretty tanky. Um, you all can hold for now. You might actually be able to beat these guys up, though. I mean, these guys are just the infantry, probably, so... Go ahead and move in if you can. I'm going to tell you guys to go ahead and just kind of hang out. And I'm going to tell the canoes to stop training and go home. If anything, I probably want to research at least cap one type of capital ship, no matter how garbage it might be. Oh, we can't even win here? Dang. Um, send you guys right here. Yeah, you guys can't even win here against a single division. That's very not promising. Oh, we're getting navally invaded. I knew it. I, oh, you guys stop training. Please stop training for the love of God. Please stop training. Go 
Good. I mean, I mean, at least we took some territory first. Good. Nice. Oh, we couldn't encircle that division. That's okay. I'll let you guys continue to move down for now. How many divisions do they have? Up to 45, maybe. Okay, they got more manpower than us after, even after we had our babies. All right, well, I'm feeling okay so about this so far. We lost 17 versus 175. It's not bad. Anti-tank rifles just in time for war. Um, can you imagine flamethrowers on Mirelurks? Grenades are cool, but flamethrower Mirelurks? I think so. Awesome. Could do that. Uh, we built those forts for no reasons. Um, it's kind of a fallback line. We'll finish that one off as well and continue doing whatever we need. That'll be good. Expand that way if you can. You guys, well, except for you, you might be able to win here, maybe. I want you to come down south. They can't pierce the Mirelurks, which is good, but they're not that strong. The more territory we take, the more territory we're going to have to cover when the enemy wants to attack us. Actually, you just come down there and there. You come down there. But then you come that way and go that way. Oh, Yakuza Territories was annexed. Well, good job, Bolt City, New Reno. Where, why are they not... What are they doing? Like, why are they not sending more men up here? This is leaving me questioning what they're doing. What is the AI doing? I'm not... I don't like this. I, 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 I don't know what's going on. I don't like like it when I don't know what the AI is doing. So a death set of Marlurks, though, which is unfortunate. Mutt fruit based drugs? Maybe. Maybe. Can we do anything on the right side of the tree here? And the swamps are going to wait for that. Vision of tactics? Less attrition. More recovery rate. Sounds pretty good. Visions of designs. Support technology. Support equipment could be added. Naval tech. Ooh, do I need to na support stuff? No, not really. Good. Um, Scrap war machines. Heavy melee weaponry. Um, Defend the tribes. We get more manpower immediately. Um, swamp roads. Uh, let's do vision of designs. Why not? Our oracles have had visions of designs. We can have our smiths make better gear for our warriors. Absolutely. Oh, Longo, bingo. Do you have anything for us? Idiot savant. It's not bad, but we need commanding officer. Not unit leader, but commanding officer stuff. Cannibal? I like the cannibal. I really do. I like less supply consumption. Planning, planning, cult of personality, smooth talker. Division defense? You know what? Tough leader sounds pretty good to me, actually. Tanks. Eh, let's get some division defense. Why not? Supply is pretty darn bad down here, though. Oh, now they've pretty much come up onto the line. That's unfortunate. You know what? I might just take you guys out, because I know the Mirelurks need as much space as possible. So you think you make the fallback line back there, and I'm just going to hold the line here, potentially. Uh, in the meantime, you could probably attack here, too. Maybe you could try to help win. That'd be great, because I could use that supply. Send another one. We can't pierce those. They're in multiple combats, which is nice. I might be able to bait them into attacking us, maybe? I need logistic companies, too. Another tries of people. At least we're in a defensive war. That's nice. Technology. Just do not let them in. Wow, we can't win at all. My god. Holy cow. Just stop attacking. Stop attacking. Just go ahead and leave. Yeah. Yeah, supply is so bad here. Oh, it's level 1. No wonder. They're trying to bait us into level 1 supply areas. Good. Go ahead and leave. Get out of here. Good. Ah. Alright, not bad. I'm not going to cut you down to 1 yet, but we'll see what happens. Visions of designs. They're trying to navally invade us some more. Okay, whatever. Scrap war machines, that sounds pretty good. The old scrap war machines we've been finding are hard for us to use. Still, perhaps we can make some use of them. In something, at least. Ah, the war support isn't super high. That's good. They still have a lot of manpower. They made a lot of divisions, though. That's probably why. Hmm, good. Free civilian factories, good. 
anything, I could... Uh, Auric is what we really need for this. I don't mind doing that a little bit first for now. Perhaps I could uh, make some civilian factories there, some right there. 50, 40, and then lots of infrastructure. Lots of infrastructure. I need more resources. Well, actually, I don't need more resources right now. I need more... Um, I need better stuff. I mean, we're civilized now. But we still only have three research slots, which kind of sucks. Alright, so this is the way it's going to have to be for a while. Yeah, I definitely need Auric. Um, you know what? If that's the case, I'm pull you out. You come to Crescent or something. Pull that division out. Come on, do that. Just so that supply is so bad. Supply use two and a half. That's a lot of supply use for an area that's literally level one. So, that's not good. Stability. We could use more stability. Which... We should actually tr probably try to get prior towards living standards. Quickly war support. Spell the Reptile just it costs quite a bit. I don't like that. Mobilize the people. Let's go prior towards living standards. The gang. Good. More combat. Less combat width. Animal observations. More breakthrough. Great. Yeah, these aren't leg infantry. Honestly, I might just use leg infantry more often. As much as I want to use, you know, Marlurks, they're not that great. Well, something I'll do, I'll look at some planes. Meyer lurks in planes? Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, I need logistic companies. Oh, crud. Oh, well, that'll wait. We'll get flamethrowers soon, and then some logistic companies. That'll be good. Old country was annexed. Good job, Washington Brotherhood. We now only have a deficit of Meyer lurks. Anti-tank rifles are being made. I need to actually throw them on my divisions, even though we're not actually fighting any of those fellas. Metal Crab Claw. That's not bad. Coral homes. We have gotten some rather big sheets of coral off of the seafloor, so we can use this coral to improve the housing of our tribesmen. Absolutely. And kind of just already baiting them into attacking me again and again and again and again. I guess for now. I'm somewhat surprised, though. There's the White Legs and Tar Walkers. That, uh, and Kaiser's Legion. That they haven't used too much power armor against me. So I'm a little surprised. You guys go ahead and throw on some anti-tank. It's going to cost you more man, cost me more manpower. But, you know what? This might be okay. Go ahead and do that for now. Uh, 1.09 political power. That's not a lot. Cultural upheavals, of course, we have. Yeah, for a while. Society is undergoing rapid change. Will the end goal as us becoming a civilized nation? Good. That's good. Flamethrower. Awesome. Logistic companies. Oh yeah, spend some some of that too. Good dynamite. Immediately get flamethrowers. Burn those humans, those dastardly humans. So far we lost 85 versus 725. So I'm feeling okay about that. At least this is against their normal infantry. Against their power armor, that might be a different uh, question. But they have tried to navally invade us a few times already. I just hope to God that the Washington Brotherhood doesn't come to us. Guerra's conviction, Coral Homes. Let's go ahead and do the freighter. Fortress? Yeah, that sounds pretty good. There are no harder metals in the waste than the old freighters. Perhaps we, we should base our tribe's home out of one of these washed ashore freighters. Sounds like a good idea. Honestly, so far with this focus tree, it doesn't seem like that extensive. It, I mean, it looks good, but it doesn't seem that extensive. But then again, I don't know. Let's see what happens. Let's see what does. I need more than 30 states. And the Tropic of Cancer. Ah, that's Mexico. I love Mexico. Good, keep baiting him into attack us, I guess. There's, uh, there's no real point to not do that. Oh, I'm getting navally invaded somewhere. Research speed, medical tech, chems, stuff. What are they attacking with? They're attacking with P. P. Hamilton Jenkins. Alright, well, we got enough infantry on that. I don't feel too concerned about that. Um, economic advisors, infrastructure, civilian stuff. I mean, I always like doing that stuff. I think it's always good to do. Uh, I could get some more stability, though. Only cost us 100. Ooh, power armor, robots, explosives, energy, infantry stuff. That's okay. Vehicles, naval, fighters, bombers, normal stuff. Make things faster. Um, more organization could be good. Yeah, more organization. But I suppose for now, we'll just go with... Base growth. Uh, I always do Captain of Industry, but I'm not doing that right now. I'm going to go with the Golden Gecko for just a slightly more uh, political power. Or basically for more stability, really. 
Camel survival to clear one of the dredgers. Good. We're building up some more infrastructure there if we need it. Actually, that'll help this tile out. Oh, actually. Huh. Only two crabs here. Level four infrastructure, but they're still on fire. Or they're still suffering from attrition. That doesn't make any sense. I wonder. What if I did this? This is bad, but... Why is supply so bad here? 17 out of 12. Um, it might be because we are sending supplies somewhere else, too. Present victory points, incoming local infrastructure. Ah, the Pirate Fortress, good. And... Oh, we need to do feeding tubes. Ooh, every leader gets more attack. Let's do some defending the tribes. We need to defend the tribe. Those who are too weak to defend themselves are the most important to keep safe. According to some. According to some. Definitely according to some. And they're going to keep attacking me down here. Keep losing that manpower, guys. It's not much. It's really not much when they attack me. But that's okay with me. Especially if I can throw some logistics companies on these guys. That'd be great. Uh, can I get better melee? Yes, yes, yes. I need those conch knives. We need some more support equipment. And we shall make some. Good. Do that. Do that. Uh, get you down to there. Make only one. Good. At least start making some support equipment, because I need to throw these on you guys. Thank you. Let's just the companies will cost 15 per group. That's okay. Yeah, their breakthrough is defense. Soft attack, not really good. That's okay, though. Uh, we have 726 bottle caps, and I have nothing really to use them on. I could set up manual prospectors, but... Mm, it's not bad. Research speed, medical chems. It's only 10. Might as well do that. I think it's worth it. Cool. Keep killing yourselves on my line, guys. You're doing a great job. Getting us maybe a little bit more army XP. Having a good time here. Uh, really, if I wanted to expand, I just need a bigger base to build from. It was either going to war with the Western Brotherhood or the Washington Brotherhood. Basically, if we wanted really to expand and that get core stuff. Ooh, defend the tribe, though. More manpower. Very nice. Uh, rock tossers. I like infrastructure. Whale hunting. Ooh, rock tossers. When the metal birds fly over us, we must be ready with sticks and stones, catapults, slingshots, arrows, whatever we can find. Good. Ah, another two divisions. Great. And you guys are just regular 10 combat with nothing super special. But you guys, 80s clear war and grabber territory. I really hope the Western Brotherhood goes to war with NCR. That'd be really good for us, actually. Good. Ah, oh, and in this battle, she's become wounded. Desert Fox, a mountaineer, good. Good, keep doing what you're doing. I mean, this is a slow grind for now, but that's okay. That's okay. Once we have planes and stuff... Oh, they're mobilizing more people. Vandenberg idea, oof. But really, for us, I mean, we're just kind of sitting here building up stuff. Love it. Ah, oh, gliders. Nothing like a bunch of Myelic planes. Ooh, we have a surplus here, nice. Could do that for now. I could use more military factories, I suppose. Continue. Where is their power armor? I mean, there's a reason why I researched anti-tank stuff. I don't know why they don't have power armor yet. Uh, this is probably a bad idea. But let's sell some manual prospectors. We might be in the middle of a war. Whatever. We got money for it. Ah, the rock tossers. Good. Good. Swamp roads. 500 caps for nothing. Coral line canoes. By lining our canoes in coral, we can improve its durability against scrapes along the rocky shoals. How many ships do these guys have? A lot more ships than me. Hmm. I don't like that. They can destroy our stuff as fast as possible. Uh, playing as a Mirelurks, I'll be honest, it's not particularly super easy. NCR joined the NCR Rangers, okay. Uh, we're getting attacked by two, three divisions. We should be able to hold out. They can't really pierce us yet, especially if we're relatively dug dug in. Anastasia, commanding officer Coral Prophet Anastasia, is learning quite a bit. And they even have the gumption to attack here. So while they're wasting their time against us, we're getting stronger. I like it. And I can core territories. Actually, 109. Three. Hmm. Let's double check. Conch knife. Yes. Heavy melee weaponry. I want that. Uh, more defense. Absolutely. Conch knives. Thank you very much. 
Can I core enemy territory? Uh, this is already a core, of course. That's already a core. This should be already a core. Yep, that's a core. Awesome. These are core states as well. Animal observations. Nice. We've got more breakthrough. Let's grab a little bit more recovery rate. That'd be great. It's not. Oh, I can core this. It's not worth very much though. Don't really need a core right now. Um, yeah, you keep attacking, guys. Keep attacking. Yeah, you'll do well. You'll do great. Vault City declared one of them. We need some more anti-tank. We need some more support equipment. That will come in time. Coral line canoes. Uh, vision of tactics. Longo Bingo. Longco Bingo gets more logistics, attack, and defense. Our oracles have visions of tactics. Perhaps we can come up with a new strategy for our soldiers. Perhaps we can. Um, outside volunteers... Military leader costs, special forces, that's kind of okay for now. Economic advisors, pre-war designs would be fun, but whatever. Aircraft, naval companies, I don't like those. Vehicles, I'm not using vehicles, that's a waste. Economic stuff, growth and base, I think we're pretty good. Even though, let's do Tance's Hassun, Hassan. Just because I'm, I'm always doing infrastructure, civilian factories. I could actually probably use a few military factories right now. Oh, nice, look at that infrastructure, 100%. And they say my lurks are uncivilized. Ha! Huh. Good. Help the settlements, help the settlements every single time if you can. Build, get more, 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 more. Hey, good. No more. No longer we have suffering from cultural people. We get slower research times. That's okay because we get more stability back and stuff like that, which is actually really, really nice. Um, good. Keep attacking me. Even at 40 combat width, they're still not that great. In the end, I want these guys to have... Yeah, that supply use is still pretty bad. Visions of tactics. Shelled warriors. That's not bad. The shelled warriors are the name for our main fighting force. Soldiers armed in the carapaces of honored Myrlurks. They pack quite a punch. The shelled warriors. Ah, oh, I love it. Actually, what are you doing? Lonko Binko, you got more stats on you, which is pretty good. And only see, there's my looks are kind of weak, honestly. Let's take a good look here. So we have the exiled heretics. They're not great, but with enough addition to their, you know, size, we could make them pretty darn good. What if I wanted reg regular inf? And I don't really think I need to add too much more to these guys. You already have pretty much everything I want on you guys for now. But for regular infantry, what if we threw in some of that, but then a lot of this? Now, that would cost more. Um, you know what, for now? Just replace these with infantry, and we'll see what happens. 16.2, that's not bad. Do that for now. Uh, I'll throw on some demos. You'll need some logistics anyways eventually, so it doesn't really matter. Ah, scavengers found something better in our hands than our enemies. We get lafting pow powwow civilian. We get faster military construction speed. Nice. That's actually, something came out of this. That was pretty useful. Great. Keep attacking us. Uh, I really wish I could attack, but these guys are so not that great. And they still have so much attrition. Shield warriors, good. Yeah, supply. Still not good. Warrior trials, good. Still, some of our shield warriors aren't as strong as we had hoped. We should put in place trials to clear out the unworthy. Less, even further less attrition, and better recovery rate. I do want to attack here, but supply is so bad. So bad. And the only way I can get it is if I continue, if I do attack here. So we're kind of stuck in the little, for now. We're stuck, and I don't like it. You guys are just kind of hanging out there. Uh, actually. Oh, I didn't tell you guys to split off. Actually. Oh, that, yeah, I did. Cool. You guys are all nine. You guys are all nine. Ah, songs from the front. Melea forces. Melea forces have fought heroically against their enemies, and one of our soldiers has composed a little poem from the front. We can play this throughout the nation to rally the nation to the cause. War support. Political power. Um, you know what? What can I use with political power? I can get more technology. Uh, actually, let's do that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Research speed? Building slots? Yeah. 
Give me more research speed for now. Uh, you guys. You're Coast Guards. Yeah, you're actually confirmed Coast Guards. It's kind of nice. Good. Manpower still going up. We're building a lot of factories. A lot of factories, which is good. Motorized flight. Good. Awesome. Build stuff there. <clears throat> Marlurks. You've heard of them. But have you heard of the Marluk bombers? I doubt you have. I really, really doubt you have. Ooh, send out manual prospectors. Yeah, we did pretty well last time. We might as well do it again. We get right now 1.45 political power a day. Good. They're still attacking us here, which is fine. Leveling up Anastasia. She's 86% of the way, becoming a mountain ear, which is great. We have suffered no casualties since we stopped attacking. They suffered about roughly 3,000. Warrior trials. Great. Now, we could do the Hardened Shell Tactic for more 6% attack, 12% defense, and we get more defensive skill. Or we get the Pinching Claw Tactic, where we get more attack, and just a little bit more defense, and more attack. I'm going to do the attack. The Pinching Claw Tactic is a war strategy based on using two flanking armies in tandem with the lead army, attacking from three directions at a time, like a Pinching Claw. Yes. Now, I could do more... Actually, it does give us defense. It's only 6%, but 12% more attack. That'll come in handy. Uh, medical chem stuff. Good. I'm joining here with my cat, Binky, who's kind of just hanging out, sleeping around. Good. Give me more organization. How much organization do these fellas have right now? Not bad. 35? Really isn't ideal, though. Really isn't ideal. I need more. These guys really aren't that great. I wish they were better. It's okay. Longco... Becoming level 2, better, good. Oh, they actually invaded us. Ooh, yay, I can actually use you guys now. Actually, you guys are already here. Alright, everyone. Actually, yeah, I might not even need you, especially if you're doing that. Yeah. Good. 3,000 losses, warrior training for even more defense. Yes, please. That would be very nice, but we can't do that yet. I could get more construction. Let's go grab some more reinforce rate. I really wish we could get more than three research slots. They just love attacking. Why, let's declare one new Canaan. Good. Manpower isn't going down for them. Night Stalkers. Good. More recovery rate. Let's grab some more soft attack and speed. These knights are just infantry, though. Hmm. Encourage weapon production. Yeah, I could do that. Cyclops, the Pitching Claw Tactic, and the Shell Games. The Shell Games are to be the greatest competition among our tribe. Only the best are allowed to compete with the winner, being her heralded among our people as the very best, or even less attrition and better recovery rate. Look at that. The Shelled Warriors. We recover very quickly. Which is something I like a lot. No wonder they tried to attack us. The 80s are looking pretty big. Look how big the 80s are getting. Holy cow. Brotherhood. For the love of God, please go to war with them, NCR. Blast from the past. They also have the followers. They're trying to enable invade me again. Pretty typical. Pretty normal stuff. Pretty un uninteresting. And we've only killed 3,500 of them. They killed off one more guy against us from like the past month or year. Uh, I am making a few planes... The only reason I'm making these planes is so that I can convert them to tactical bombers. That's really the only reason why. i do that for now. That'd be good. 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 Keep making stuff, guys. You're doing a great job. 20, 30... Eh, come over here. Good. Anti-tank. Looking better and better every day. Could I attack here and win? I probably couldn't. Oh, but hold on. Hold the phone. If we're going to attack and win here, I will pull off one more from that side. Good. Kick him out. The shell game's good. I'm kind of glad we waited to attack. In the swamps, we'll wait for that a little bit longer. I want that to get everywhere. Let's do feeding the tribe. Feeding the tribe should be the paramount priority among our people. An unfed tribe is an unhappy tribe. You don't want pissed off tribe members. No, 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 no. Um, veteran military academy training. 
Even better organization? Yes. I don't care about training time too much. You can always deploy stuff, people out if you need to. I really don't want to do this. I'm going to do patrols here. I doubt they'll do anything. Ooh, no two ones are on fire. Good, good, good. What if I did convoy rating? I doubt we'll find anything over there, though. If we could win here... Do we have any... Hmm... What's the range on these gliders? Barely enough to get down here. Could they do really well? There goes dredgers. Whee! Good. Oh, we took the province. Great! Fine. Oh, we got another division here. Awesome. Nice. I'm actually going to throw you right here. I'm going to immediately build up the infrastructure here. Because we'll be fighting here for quite a while. Now, I know I spent most of the time just kind of waiting here, waiting for us to take this tile. But that's okay. Let things get a little bit more organized. Anastasia became a mountaineer. So that's pretty good. Mountaineer expert. Maximum assignable traits. Oh, she has... She's a savage leader. Hey, we found something better in our hands than our enemies. Some naval technology for some reason. Great. Kill these guys off. You guys are looking a little better than before. A lot of HP. I like it. I like it a lot. We can't pierce you. And actually, you ooh, you need to come down here too. You got some... Mostly all the anti-tank you need, all the flamers you need, the myrlurks you need, as well as the support equipment. So that's not bad. Feeding the tribe, good. Brine battlers, more attack. Let's let's wait on that. Coral apprenticeship. So coral is very difficult to work. In truth, if we do nothing in a few generations, because there's a, there might be a chance that this cultural practice will go the way of the old world. We need to ensure that this generation is teaching the next the same knowledge they know. Absolutely. Hmm. I like building slots. Good. Crush them. And actually build up some air bases here, too. Because we're going to need them. 23 days until we can start making bombers. Good. Oh, we found some power armor. They can't pierce us, but we can pierce them. For the most part. Amazing. Good. Another division. Which is totally fine with me, since we will have enough supply down here. Which would be very good. Losses for the enemies. 4,000. 110 for us. Not bad. Oh. Okay. Sure, why not? Yeah, you guys go ahead and keep trying to attack me with power armor. I've already prepared for this. I can pierce that division. Nice. Oh, and we countered a little bit of resistance. Then that's okay. Here, we there's no airbase here yet. I thought it was... Yeah, there it is. I wonder where that's going to be, though. We should have it. If I can make an encirclement, that would be great. They're attacking us again with a single division at a time, which makes no sense. Oh, uh, we encircled a division. Greatness, greatness, greatness. Medical kit. Just sure, why not? Screw it. Why the hell not? And now we can have bombers. Yes. Now, I've, I kind of have ignored all this industrial stuff for now. Which isn't always a good idea. Oh, good. Good job, guys. Go ahead and convert you to bombers. Just because they have way more attack. Ground attack that I want. Ooh, we need electricity. Yeah. I'm going to need more planes. I'm going to need more military factories. I'm going to need more resources. All that really good, delightful stuff. Oh, did they naval invade me? They looks like they have. So, you guys have orders again. Great. Coral apprenticeship. So, Brian Battlers, here's what I'm going to do. You, where are you guys at? Good. I'm going to buy two more for now. And it costs us 21 political power. That's not bad. I'm going to do searching shipwrecks, though. We found some old diving suits during a recent scavenging hole. Perhaps we should use this to search some of the old shipwrecks off the coast. I just want to at least get one or two more generals before I do any of the next focuses. That would be good. That would be very good, actually, for us. Bombers, come on. You guys are doing okay. Supply. We're still improving it, which is good. Could you very carefully attack? and be successful. That's the most important thing. Uh, you're getting attacked. It's not good. Send you two this way. Good. 
and maybe one more after this guy, just so that we'll probably have as many generals as we'll need for a while. It does cost money, or really political power to do that. Good, good, good. Camel Station was annexed, awesome. If you guys could win, go ahead and attack. Oh, Laughing powwow is done, that's unfortunate. That's okay, though. Good. Just not making any bombers yet. Any more factories over here? Um, you can do that probably. Put you underneath. I want to make some conch shells. One a month. We need electricity. I can trade that away to Vault City. That'll be good enough. That'll be good. Yeah, that should be good enough to make. Yeah, that's a good amount. Primitive radio, awesome. Eighty declared war in rightful territory. Let's get some more research speed. Help speed things up along the way. You guys immediately begin attacking. All of you begin to attack. With you guys following up an attack. Then you guys coming down here and then doing that. Actually, you know what? Screw it. You're not going to attack that way. You're going to attack that way. You're going to give them time to kill these guys off. Stop attacking. Searching shipwrecks. Great. And then... They'll do this scrap excavation. Hauling scrap out of the ocean is of big importance to us. We've got a nice haul recently. Good. Okay, give it time. You know what? If you need another guy, come over here. And... Awesome. Hold. You guys come down there. You guys kill him off. There's two whole divisions here. Two more enemy divisions. Oh, and they immediately invaded us again. Uh, pretty much expected. There you go. There we go. I will end the episode very soon. And now they're attacking us once again. Good, redeploy across the line, and then we have to get into Arcata, which will be relatively difficult to strike into because we don't have good enough supply down there. But, oh well. Anyways, guys, I'm pretty much going to end, be ending the episode here because, well, we haven't done very much, but we're being successful nonetheless. We've lost a couple guys, we've killed off 5,000 of them. Heaven's Gate looking pretty good. Anyways, thank you very much for watching, guys. If you like the video, maybe you consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow as we shall continue pushing into the Western Brotherhood of Steel's territory and achieving coastal success. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.